I am bored. <laughs> so let's give episode a little play. Of course, this video is a video in a series. If you haven't seen the first several, go down to the description box and watch the first several episodes. It'll be worth your time. If you don't feel like doing that, then here is a little 15 second recap of the first episodes of episode. The old test wouldn't have dared talk to me like that. Well, I ain't the old test. Don't talk to my girl that way. Shut the fuck up, Jay. Don't- we're, are we playing 20 questions about your dick? Holy shit, you just did jazz hands. Stop. Stop! What is this music? I feel like Cole and I are gonna get it on to this music. Bow chick ow. Bow chick ow. Cole, your dick, it feels so good. Was that too far? Was that too far? You know what, let's just start. Let's just play. Chapter 8. Do you think we should put her hair up or down? I literally have no hair. It's so short. But I'll forgive you, Megan. If you don't know, I have a crush on Megan, cause, uh, let me just look at her. Mm. Down. Beth, ugh, fuck you up. Guys, shh, you need to glow, Tessa. <laughs> and pick the perfect accessory for your dress. Hoop earrings are out and brooches are in. What are brooches? Are those see-through pants that I'm wearing? I personally think a pearl necklace will be classy and sexy. Of course you do. I trust your judgment, Megan, because, uh, you know you're hot. Guys, you're making me nervous. Just let me handle this. I can't believe we're actually going to the Founders Ball. I know, ever since Cole came back to town, I feel like I get noticed more in the hallways. It's like our social status went up 20 points by association. Hey, Cole's kind of popular. He drags us lowly fucking losers up. If you told the old tester that Cole Stone was going to take you to one of the biggest social events of the year, <laughs> why is why is Megan face palming so hard? <laughs> I don't know if she is or if she's just smelling. Maybe she, she did the perfume dab thing and she's just like... <sighs> no one else does that? Just me? Okay. And buy you a dress and sweep you off your feet and kiss you. Wait, he kissed you? Oh yeah, it was between the prison bars. It was so romantic. Well, I mean, he's kissed me before. What? She's been holding out on us. Tell us everything. Don't kiss and tell. It was everything you dreamed it would be. It was just okay. <laughs> no, I, I've always dreamed that my first kiss would happen in a jail. So yeah, my heart nearly stopped. I could feel every nerve ending. Everything felt like it was in slow motion. So he's a good kisser? No. No? If he, she says he's a great kisser, I'm a puncher. He's better than good. He held me. I'm gonna uh, punch. Tessie, I know you're going to look amazing tonight. Oh, thanks, Cole. But I just want to make sure I'll live up to your hotness. <laughs> Speak of the devil. LOL, thanks. What's up? This is embarrassing. What is? I don't know what to wear. Just don't wear your stupid fucking ripped jeans. I'm so sick of your ripped jeans, go. Stop with your leather and stop with the ripped jeans. He wants me to go over and help him choose his outfit for the ball. Well, what are you waiting for? Go dress him and be the best looking couple there. Yeah, girl. Thanks for the support, Megan. Make Nicole die. You know what? I don't even want to finish reading the rest of what she said. I just want to make Nicole die. That's exactly what I want to do. Of jealousy. Well, that's disappointing. And Jay wish he were there with you. Man, fuck Jay. I don't give a shit about Jay. And get another kiss out of Cole while you're at it. Oh, no. <laughs> I have 33 gems left. I made the mistake of buying gems, but I'm not paying money. I'm not paying 25 gems. I only have 33 left. I'm not going over. You're going to look great no matter what you wear. Okay, it's time. We need to get you into your mystery outfit. I still can't believe he bought you a dress. I'm still reeling from that. This dude went online and shopped for women's dresses. And for some reason, I'm getting the feeling this is not the first time he's done that. I should have went over to Cole's house and just checked in his closet because I feel like he would just have an assortment of skirts and dresses. <laughs> he's the kind of guy that's like, you know what, Jaden Smith wore a dress I can't do. Respect, Cole. Hey, 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 little handsy there, Megan. You literally take my breath away. <laughs> it kind of looks funereal. It kind of looks like something you wear to a funeral. I'm glad there's no rips in your jeans, Cole. I'm satisfied. You'd literally be dead. Wow. Where did you get that fucking camera? 1930? Is this 2018? Why is there a giant flash on top of your camera? <laughs> Stop. Stop with the ain't. Who... Who takes this picture? Smile for the camera. Snap, snap. Snap, snap. Snap. No, this is how you take a picture in 2018. Cole, stand up straight. Better. You two look so good together. Were you trying to rhyme? 
You trying to start a music career, mom? Oh, I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it. Jay, you look fucking stupid as shit. What are they doing here? It's his fucking house. <laughs> I thought you could share the limo. Oh. I know she's a bitch, but it's only one night, dear. I'm gonna throw her out. She's gonna, like, stick her head out in the limo, and I'm gonna push her out. <laughs> she's gonna fucking fall out of the limo. And then I'm gonna be like, limo driver, can you back up? Thump, thump, thump. What was that? I just have so many murder fantasies with this bitch, Nico. <laughs> it sounded like something alien. I don't know. For so every time I do one of these episodes, I think maybe it's because I'm doing so much talking that I just burp so much. I want you to have something, Tessa. Oh, it's a little, it's a necklace. Oh my god, it's gorgeous. It's really not. It's yours. Here, I want to give you something too. It's my V-card. Cole's gonna take it in a couple hours. What's this for? It was my mother's, and now it's yours. Jesus Christ. Are you serious? I've been dating your son for like a day. Our first kiss came in prison. Are you sure you want to give your family jewels to me? I'm pretty sure Cole's going to give me his family jewels tonight, if you know what I'm saying. In honor of being the first girl to make Cole act like a gentleman. Don't thank me. That dress is the really amazing thing. Cole went out of his way to get it. Really? He went on Amazon. Fuck you. Ordered it special from my designer friend. I don't really understand the dynamic here because I know Cole's dad is a cop. But look at the size of their house. It's massive. There's like marble pillars. I don't know what she does. I don't know why she married a cop, but she definitely married down. She's got designer friends. No one has even worn it yet. It's for next season. <laughs> what the fuck are you talking about? That is the most punchable face ever. All right. So how does it feel to be the belle of the ball? Freaking rocks. How does it feel to be such a lady? Fist bump. Yeah, 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 yeah. This ain't the Jersey Shore, Tessa. Calm your shit. Wow, extreme close-up on the back of that guy's head. Except for that snake. I wish he wasn't here. Let's not talk about her. I'm enjoying my moment with you. It's our time to shine. You're right, Shortcake. I just can't believe Jay is with her. Nicole is great at manipulating people. Unfortunately, Jay's her latest victim. I almost feel sorry for him. But hey, you've got me now. You sure you still want me? Aw, Cole's being bashful. You're not my bully anymore, Cole. You're my friend, and guess what? What? Wait, we're friends? I thought we were getting it in tonight. We're gonna have a good time. You're wrong, Tessa. <gasps> I am? I promised you'd have a great time. That's not funny. Don't laugh. That was a pity laugh. All right, ladies and gentlemen, mingling time is over. Go to your separate chambers until 8 p.m. <laughs> what? What sort of party is this? We're getting locked in chambers? No one ever listens. Well, that's because no one wants to go to their fucking chamber. You're gonna do great, hun. Thanks, mom. Try not to dream about me while I'm gone. Man, at this point, we're getting so cutesy, it's kind of making me want to vomit. I think I'll manage on my own. Oh, I bet you Nicole tries to steal that necklace. That's what I think is going to happen. I think Nicole's going to steal the necklace and try to make me look bad in front of Cassandra. <laughs> Why was there a close-up on that pillar? What are you still doing with Nicole? Did you really have to rush over in order to say that? Like that's just been on your mind all day. It had to get out ASAP. It's complicated. Or you're just whipped. He is whipped. I just can't believe you choose Nicole over Tessa. That's something I never do. And trust me, I've had the chance. What the hell is that supposed to mean? Ooh. Oh. What the hell is that doing here? Yeah, Hank's got the wig on. I made him bald a couple episodes ago. That's why I bought the gems. And why is he wearing a wig? I'm gonna kill that piece of shit. How about you tag team and beat the fuck out of him? Right after I yank his weave out. <laughs> My first inclination is to say that a guy, a tough guy who went to military school, is on the football team, isn't gonna say I'm gonna yank his weave out. That's just not the kind of terminology that kind of guy uses usually. But then again, Cole's buying dresses online, so I feel like he would use that phrase. Hang on, I've got a better idea. Hank, listen. What do you want, Stone? Jay got Hank kicked off the football team, and Hank had a scholarship to Alabama. And that's like the best football school in the nation. So Hank's got to be pretty pissed. I want to apologize for getting kicked off the team. So he's not going to bring my scholarship back. Or my... <laughs> Sorry. Oh, that's great. I love how sad he looks about this too. Or my real hair. I have a plan though to get you back on the team. 
I've already talked it through with Coach Miller. How so? Tess is a real crazy bitch. Tell me about it. I had to draw these eyebrows. <laughs> I mean, first she looks at you like she wants some, and then she says she didn't. Like, what the hell? Fuck you, J-Man. I don't care if this is like a, a plot. Don't talk bad about me. Yeah, when Nicole told me that Tessa wanted to fool around. Well, let me just say, your girlfriend is so cool helping me get chicks like that. I mean, I never would have gone after Tessa if Nicole hadn't told me to put it on thick. Yeah, you were real thick. I felt it. Brushing against my leg. Okay, so now Jay knows. Jay now knows that uh, Nicole was the one who put him up to it. Hey, good job. It's crazy that I'm here. Uh, why aren't you in your chamber, bitch? Oh, that's some pretty necklace you got there. I knew it. I knew she's going up to the necklace. Thanks. It was supposed to be mine. I'm sorry? I am not sorry. Don't apologize. I'm sorry, I'm not sorry, bitch. Don't act cute with me. The dress, the necklace, Cole. You've rigged the whole ball. Man, I'm about to rig Cole's balls inside my vagina. I've what? You're out of your mind, Nicole. Please leave me alone. What, too afraid to tangle with the big league girls? <laughs> Gonna go cry to your mommy, the head of the ball? What is wrong with you? That's a good ass question. I didn't think you'd actually show your face here. I thought you learned something from the last time you tried to cross me. I never crossed you, Nicole. I went to a party. And you had a guy assault me in the bathroom. Facts. No one's ever gonna believe that fairy tale, especially from a slut like Tessa Middleton. I swear. You know what, Nicole? Let me put this necklace on for you. Oh, thank you, Tessa. Oh, it's so pretty. Yes, let me tighten it for you. Uh, uh, Tessa, <laughs> Tessa, I think it might be tight. Too tight, that's, that's not... Cry all you want. You don't have your stone voice to protect you now. Oh, you didn't see Jay there, who's literally right next to you? Jay, I didn't see you there, even though our shoulders are touching. Hey, free gym. Chapter 9. Cry all you want. You don't have your stone voice to protect you now. Hey, what's up, Jay? You heard that, right? That's where you're wrong, Nicole. Jay, babe, thank goodness you're here. Tessa was bullying me, telling me that I wasn't pretty and didn't deserve to have you. Those are things that I would definitely say. I don't mind if Jay believes that because it's that's what I'm thinking. That's enough, Nicole. What? Jay, please. I'm not the enemy. She is. I wanted to believe you, Nicole. I really did. Because you've been giving me that vagina every week. But I cannot turn a blind eye anymore. Unless you want to head to our chamber. But Jay. Stop. You've had your turn. Holy shit, those are some angry eyebrows. How could you do this to Tessa? To me? You actually sent Hank into the bathroom to, to... To to do what exactly? Assault your best friend? Do you realize how sick and twisted that is? I am so glad she made the face. This face, this is how you know a character is just all out of sorts. Uh, what did Tessa ever do to deserve that? Jay, you don't understand. If you really love me, then look me in the... Oh, again with the face. And look me in the eyes and tell me you didn't do this. Tell me I'm wrong. Hey, what's up, Cole? I, I, you can't, can you? You lied to my face about everything. Not everything, baby. I still want to be together. Well, I don't. Not anymore. <gasps> yeah, walk off all sad, bitch. I'm sorry, Tessa. I should have known. I should have done something sooner, but... Tell Jay sorry won't cut it or accept Jay's apology. I'm gonna tell him that sorry's not gonna cut it in hopes that he physically harms Nicole. <laughs> sorry, Jay. Do you realize how miserable I've been? If you really cared about me, you would have figured this out much sooner. And if you really care about me, go throw that bitch out of a moving limo. Please, Tessa, forgive me. I know I didn't listen, but God, I feel so stupid. Well, you should. Will you let me make it up to you? At this point, murder. Murder Nicole. All is forgiven. I promise I can do better. I can be a better friend. I'll think about it. Baby, please. You have to believe me. Have to believe you what? You just admitted that everything you did was lies. I didn't want for any of this to happen. You're gonna really be thinking that when I kick you out the door of a limo. It's all a simple misunderstanding. If you just let me explain it. I actually want to hear her explanation so that I can tear her down. Nicole, we're done. Don't call me. Don't text me. Don't come near me ever again. I don't need you, Jay Stone. I don't need any of you. Whoa, she flipped. If you think this is over, it isn't. Actually, this is over. It's not. She's gonna steal the necklace. Now everyone will know just how cold-hearted Nicole Andrea Bishop really is. That's a fucking stupid name. Good luck finding a dance partner tonight. Or ever again. Ah! 
<laughs> Run off, bitch. Ladies and gentlemen, please take your seats as the 20th annual Founders Ball commences. It's time. Are you ready? I think so. Tessa, wait. She doesn't want to talk about it. But I just wanted to say I'm sorry. You've done enough already. Man, he did the right thing though. I feel like, I feel bad now. I feel a little bit bad. Wow, are we at a concert? Now let's, what is that mustache, bro? He needs to take tips from me on how to grow a good mustache, I think. Now let's welcome our first couple to the stage, Cole Stone and Tessa Middleton. That's what we do. We dance on stage. This is the most boring show I've ever seen. I still can't believe I'm dancing up here with you. I hate to break it to you, Shortcake, but this is all a dream. Shut up. Sorry to disappoint, but it's true. Even you can't ruin this moment. I wouldn't even dare. Sit down in front. I can't believe Jay finally knows the truth. Hey, Shortcake, eyes on me, remember? I'm sorry, I know. What are you thinking about? Just hold me, please. Always. <laughs> Man! This night is not about Nicole or anybody else. It's about you and me. And now, let's welcome Beth Barker and Travis Middleton to the stage. Is he coming? Oh my god! My friend is dating my crackhead brother. When did they get together? Beats me. Are you upset? You're happy for your best friend or you're annoyed? No, I'm annoyed! Man, she's gonna get pulled into his drug world. I just don't know how she could go behind my back like that with my own crackhead brother. Love is love. No, she's not in love. She's delusional or high. She may have gotten a contact high from his lips. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. What is she up to? She's dating the bald motherfucker who's got his ass kicked by my boyfriend. And finally, our last couple... Nicole Andrea the Bitch Bishop and Hank the Rapist Fontaine. <laughs> Not satisfied. Wait, did he show up without a date? Is that why he can get up with Nicole? Did his butt cheeks just shift? Was that was that in my mind or did I actually see his butt cheeks shift? I'm not surprised. Nicole was never going to sit this dance out. She's twisted. I just don't know how she got this way. What happened to make her so vicious? Let's not think about that now. Let's just have fun. Sure, Cake. Where are you going? Maybe I should go talk to Jay. I bet he's having a pretty rough night. What? Why? Think about how he must feel. So? <laughs> Great brother you are. We're supposed to be enjoying our nights, aren't we? I'm not so sure. You seem to be more interested in my brother than me. Ooh, problems cropping up. What? You've barely taken your eyes off of him. Cole, Jay is my- it's because of his stupid ass jacket. I can't get over the fact that he decided to wear that in public, that ugly jacket. Cole, Jay is my friend. He's always been my friend. I know. He messed up, but I should still be there for him when he needs someone to talk to. Just don't go falling in love with him, okay? <laughs> trust me, that's not a problem. Cole, I'm here with you. Okay, I trust you. Attaboy. You're such a good person. That's what I really love about you, Tess. Should I talk to Jay? Be a good friend and make sure Jay is okay or don't talk to Jay. I don't give a shit about Jay. He can go fuck himself. And in fact, now that he's not dating a D Nicole anymore, I'm pretty sure he's going to be. If it's that big of an issue, I'll just stay with you. Sorry, I guess it's cruel of me to deprive you of your beloved Jay. How did this turn into a fight? I decided to stay with you. Why are you acting so jealous? I've seen the way you look at him. Again, it's the jacket. Oh, and now you're pissed. Great. Cole, wait. Why are you acting so weird, Cole? The better question is, why are you making excuses for Jay? I've had your back from the start. That's true. Truth. He didn't know. You can't blame him for all this. When are you going to start seeing me for me and not some bully? Cole, man, you're, you're way too into your feelings right now. You always carry a torch for this clown. <laughs> it's your brother, bro. This clown. Well, I've been trying to get your attention for 10 years. That's not- You've been like destroyed. You sprained my wrist. You've like broken my spine. Yeah, you've got my attention by physically harming me for like my entire childhood. That's not true. And what do I get in return? Poor Jay. I'm just trying to be a good friend. Good friend, I'm sure. It's always been Jay, hasn't it, Tessa? Folks, it's time to announce the Founders Ball King and Queen, Tessa Middleton and Goldstone. 
Now, let's welcome our Founders Ball King and Queen. Come on up here, kids. Come take a look at my mustache up close. That is the weirdest clap I've ever seen. <laughs> oh, bitch crying. Hank wasn't gonna win. He doesn't even have any real hair. I don't know what to say. I, I can't believe I'm standing up here. It's so surreal. I probably don't deserve this crown. Why are you in quotes? Who are you quoting? That's what the old me would have said. That I'm unworthy, not smart, not pretty enough. But this year, something changed. I lost a bunch of weight. Somebody finally, truly believed in me. Somebody I've known since I was a kid. Someone I never thought I could be with. This somebody, he really showed me a new side of himself tonight. It turns out that he's always believed in me. All those years, I never knew. I never knew how he felt. But he's the only reason I'm standing here in front of you tonight. It better be Cole. Grateful and honored and finally so happy to be myself. So thank you, Cole Stone. Thank you for never giving up on me. And always being there and even when I was too blind to notice. Hey, I'm scoring some major points, man. Oh, yeah. Hey, you look hot, Megan. Ah, oh, yeah. You thought I was going to thank you, Jay, you dumb motherfucker. To be continued. This is such a high note. I feel like the series couldn't be over. Hey, another gym. Everything's going right, although we're only like a third of the way through the series. There's a lot of treachery. Nicole, she's gonna do some crazy stuff and uh, it's gonna be bad. There's still a lingering mystery of what my brother and Travis, what that was all about. And not enough harm has befallen Nicole. So we're gonna get into that later in this series. If you would like to see more, let me know in the comment section. Hit the like button on this video. There's actually another mobile game that I wanted to uh, to play, and I think that should be fun. Go back and watch the first video if you are so inclined, and then there's another video you might enjoy as well. I'm really craving to do another binge on this channel, so I think there's gonna be a binge very, very soon. I love you guys. Have a great rest of your day.